Good morning. Today, March 26, I'm gonna buy a second-hand car. Maybe it costs 4,300 4, in Australian dollar or 43 juta rupiah. So, let's go. Did you make a yogurt and grapes? So you wanna try? Wanna try? Okay, let's go. Mm, how's that? Yummy? Let's go. Here's the location of the car. We need <laughs> Diane's help to drive the car home. So this is my new car here. I bought it for $4,300. dollars want to see inside. All right. I think it costs more expensive in Indonesia, maybe 100 something. It's uh, from 2011. Check this out. Still clean. With the spare tires here. This is the second door. Still have space for me. Yeah. That's a nice small car. Really clean. Like brand new. Also have the power window. Aircon, of course, to make it cold or hot in the winter. The driver seat also can set the volume for the radio. I think. Let's check the machine. Sixteen P D O H C. The machine looks clean too. Also have the manual book here and the service history here. So if we buy a car in Australia, we should make the transfer paper, like the notification of change of ownership. We fill in the vehicle details here, the seller's details and the purchase's details and all that. Because I don't have the Driving license yet? Maybe tomorrow I'm gonna drive this one. Nah, kalau di Australia wajib anak kecil pakai car seat kayak gini. Sekarang mau pasang di mobilnya. Kalau di bagian atas kita harus ngomongin ke bagian belakang besi ini. Ada beberapa mobil yang besinya ada di bagian sini. Jadi belt juga harus disangkutin dari sini masuk ke sini, habis itu di strap ke seat belt ini. Okay, so it's ready to go with the new car. Okay, guys. Thank you for watching. See you on my next video. Bye.